Hi everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel Arun Daddy Tech for you. In this video, we are going to learn how to insert header, footer, page number, page border, and watermark. So, friends, if you don't want to miss my video, please subscribe my channel Arun Daddy Tech for you. And don't forget to like my videos. Coming to MS Word, I have prepared some notes and now I want to add header to my notes. To add header to my notes, I will just go to the insert tab. In insert tab, you will find a header option. And if you click the header option, you will get a multiple options. So you can select, let me select the first option. And you can see a text type here. So let me type as a question bank. So I will just type question bank. Nice. Now you can find a close header and footer option. If you click that automatically, it will go now nice right so you got the question bank as a header let me check the next pages see second page and let me go to the third page nice so i got my header now so the same way if you want footer you can again go to the insert tab go to the footer and here you can find uh, different options you can choose one and you can type nice right so let me go to the next option called page number and uh, you can see here below the footer you will find a page number option if you click that you will get a uh, option like top of the page bottom of the page page margin custom position generally i like bottom of the page so i will just go to the bottom of page and i will select one of the option nice now you can see uh, it's uh, showing the number one so let me type some text before the number one so i will just say uh, page number colon okay and space nice and i will just say close header again i will just click on a close header and footer nice now let us see see this is showing as the page one you can also increase the size and uh, make it bold if you want and uh, let me go to the next page you can see page number two let me go to the next page number three see automatically it has created the page numbers nice right now let us move to the next option which is page border for getting a page border you have to go to the design uh, design tab in the design tab it uh, on the right side corner you can see it's a page border option when you click on a page border option a dialog box will appear and uh, in that you can select different styles colors width art so let me select the style as a double line so i will I, I will prefer double line so i will just select double line and uh, remaining i will keep it as it is and click ok nice now you can see how it looks let me zoom out so you can see nicely see it's looking very good nice right now again let me zoom in now i want to add a watermark to add a watermark you can find a watermark option immediately next to next to the page border and if you click on watermark automatically you will find a option called customize watermark so let me select this customized watermark and immediately after selecting the customized watermark you will get a dialog box so let me choose a dialog box in the dialog box you can find two options one is picture watermark and text watermark first i will go with the text watermark then i will move to the picture watermark so let us uh, first i will just type here uh, in the place of text i will type arun ready tech for you which is my channel name so arun ready tech for you nice and uh, i i just uh, same i don't want much uh, dark border so i will just keep it as it is diagonal yes horizontal it will be a straight so i want a diagonal and i will just say apply okay nice so when i click okay automatically you can see below the you can see the border right so let me see let's let me make it side and uh, you can see okay just close i forgot to close the button okay now you can see there's a watermark right arun ready tech for you you can see if you want bold a little bit uh, dark one you can also do it just uh, select the dark colors so i will just select the dark colors and click ok see you got dark nice right 
suppose you want to make it watermark as a horizontal okay horizontal uh, it will be a, like a sleeping line click okay see you can see right let us go to the next option which is a uh, picture so let us select a picture for selecting picture you first select picture watermark and click on a select picture so when you select automatically you'll get a three option try again work offline cancel so i don't have a net now so i will just go to the work offline and i want to select uh, my logo okay so my youtube logo i want to select so i will just go to the um, options where it will is available so let me go to the folder and in the folder i will just select the logo option here we so i'll just select insert and um, click okay nice nice you can see now uh, you can see my watermark okay so if i if i if i want to make it little big i will just again go to the select picture work offline again i will select logo nice insert and this time i will just select 100% so i want to make my watermark big nice you can see nice right okay you can see that very good right so this is how we can uh, select um, insert header footer page number borders and watermarks nice right so friends keep practicing thank you